kita kali ini kita bakal sharing ngobrol bareng sama teman aku dari Taiwan. Yeay! Banyak hal termasuk alasan kenapa dia kok bisa jauh-jauh dari Taiwan ke Australia. Guys, ini lagi menuju ke kamar teman aku yang ada di lantai 2. Hi Sally, hi and kita tinggal di akomodasi yang sama jadi makanya kita bisa ketemu walaupun kita beda jurusan terus juga hmm, kita ada di kampus yang sama walaupun beda jurusan beda major dan lain sebagainya nanti kita bakal share apa aja kesibukan Sally terus um, hobinya apa dan lain sebagainya pokoknya banyak banget. Hi Sally, hi can you tell us uh, what do you study now? I'm studying accounting and I'm a bachelor student. Oh, nice. Yeah. <laughs> What year are you? Um, this is my first year. Oh, great. So, why do you choose that subject? Why do you study accounting? Um, because I want to be an accountant in the future. So, I just choose study accounting directly. Oh, yeah, yeah. great. And also, I love math. So, oh, I choose I accounting. Yeah. Accounting is very difficult. For me, I think, yeah, in my opinion, <laughs> most of Indonesian students have a content because yeah. Yeah, it's math and there are so many calculations. Mm. Yeah. So, why do you come to Australia? Um, because because my partner also is Australia. Ah, I yeah. see. So yeah, if I that's come good. Here, if I come here, we can help each other. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And this is the first reason. And the second reason is uh, the tuition fee in Australia is cheaper than the other countries. Oh. Cheaper than America or British. Okay, so that's the reason. So because the affordable cost, so you come here and then... So you have a friend already, so that's why you decided to come to Australia. That's nice. Yeah. Yeah. Are you happy to stay yeah. in Australia? I'm happy. Um, I have been here for seven months and so far so good. Everyone is good and nice in here. And I really like Australia, this country. Yeah, because you are so nice. You are so lovely. So that's why many people love to be talking to your friends, of yeah. course. Yeah, and I'm happy to be your friend as well. <laughs> and um, why you choose UOW? Um, because there are two reasons. One of the reasons is UOW, they provide me scholarship. So oh, you can release my financial burdens. Mm -hmm. So this is the first reason. The, another reason is my partner he's in Canberra mm -hmm. and Wollongong is not too far from Canberra. Yeah. So, so I choose this. Yeah, I see. So that's a great reason I think. Yeah. 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 Lovely. Mm -hmm. And actually, what is your hobby? Because uh, I heard that you have many activities and you become. A resident ambassador in international house, so yeah. yeah. <laughs> this is the teacher. Yeah, this yeah. is the teacher. Yeah, she's international student, and she becomes a resident ambassador in our accommodation. That's yeah. So, what's your hobby? Can you um, tell us? I think I have lots of hobby. I like reading books and watching movies. And a few days ago, I'm learning hand language. What is it? Which is called sign language. This oh, language is for God. deaf people yeah, or yeah, yeah. they cannot speak. Oh, so they need to use God. hand to communicate. Oh, and yeah. I just learned it three days ago on YouTube. 
thought you joined a course, but you learn from YouTube. So oh. you basically love to learn new things, right? Yeah, because oh, that's great. Yeah, because I choose to learn in this language on YouTube is is free, and mm -hmm. I can learn it at, at any time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and um, I think a few months ago, I also learned another language which is mm -hmm. called Cantonese. Oh, yeah. although Cantonese is also in the Mandarin inside, but I cannot speak Cantonese, but mm. I still want to learn it. Yeah. Wow. For me, if I learn new language, it will take like maybe months or years, so uh, I will like think twice if I have to learn new language. Mm -hmm. If I have free time, maybe I will try to learn new language. Yeah, does, yeah. I, I want to. You are so busy. <laughs> yeah, because maybe I'm so lazy. Mm -hmm. I'm so lazy to do my research, so that's why I'm busy like busy every day. Yeah. Because I'm so lazy, <laughs> so I have to finish it like soon. So after that, maybe I can have free time and learn language, and maybe I can go with you some to somewhere and yeah, we can do something fun together. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's nice. So. Would you mind to share who is like the most popular celebrity in Taiwan? Well, I think the most popular celebrities in Taiwan is J. Zhou. Oh, he, yeah. do you know him? I've heard about him before yeah. I think J. Zhou. Yeah, yeah, He's a singer. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah I, I think so. I think so. Yeah. But Jibian and Epson are famous in my country. <laughs> Basically, yeah. Okay. Metal Garden. Yeah. Although Major Garden was a drama like years ago, but it's still popular nowadays. Yeah. 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 I I watch the drama by the way. Yeah. I really like it. <laughs> <laughs> so do you have any favorite place in Taiwan? Favorite place? Yeah. To visit? Um, or maybe like when you want to go somewhere in Taiwan you have? Place, or maybe the most popular place in Taiwan. If I go uh, to Taiwan, maybe I should visit this place. I think maybe maybe Taipei One Hundred One. Oh yeah, the yeah, tallest Taipei building yeah, in yeah, Taiwan. Yeah, 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 yeah. But um, yeah, this is the most popular, and um, every tourist came to Taiwan, they must visit Taipei One Hundred One. But for me, I would recommend. Maybe, maybe mountains in Taipei. Oh, mountain. Yeah, there is oh. a mountain called Xiangshan, and Xiangshan translate to English is called Elephant Mountain. Mm. Yeah, and oh, sounds nice. Yeah, and this mountain is quite amazing because Taipei is a very crowded city, mm. and lot of people in there. So actually, Taipei had no. Um, the land in Taipei is so density. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, um, which means having a mountain in Taipei is really um, how to say? It's really uncommon. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah. But yeah. after you climb up the Elephant Mountain, and there's a lookout. You on the lookout and looks through the looks through the view, you can see the whole Taipei city. Oh, and, yeah, and I think the view is very good. Sounds so nice. Maybe uh, I should go there. Yeah. If I visit Taiwan. Mm. Yeah. I will ask you maybe the combination. Yeah, of course. <laughs> <laughs> and the food of course also like the restaurants, the visit and everything. Yeah, yeah and uh, so you are a YouTuber as well. So could you tell us what channels about and um, why did you like build that channel? Okay, <laughs> so yeah, I have, I also have my YouTube channel and my channel name is called Shelly. It's like my name. name. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> and in my YouTube, I will create some vlogs or sometimes I fly, I fly drone, so wow. I also have some drone videos mm -hmm. and I also have my own podcast. Yeah, and why I want to start my YouTube channel is because I think 
study abroad, I need to um, feel it myself and keep this memory mm. and share to yeah. everyone. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, see. I enjoy your YouTube channel. Yeah. yeah. And you do it very well. <laughs> it's really nice. Yeah. And refreshing. Maybe you guys you can check Sally's YouTube channel. It's yeah. really nice. <laughs> and you can learn English as well, especially IELTS. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. IELTS. Yeah. IELTS. So. Uh, what is Taiwan's official language, by the way? Oh, Taiwan's official language is Mandarin, same uh, as China. Same as China. Yeah. But we also have our own local language oh, called Taiwanese. Oh, so it's different or different? Like exactly different? Yeah, like Cantonese and Mandarin. That's like really different. Right? So uh, is it like same? Yeah, Taiwanese is totally different from Mandarin. Oh. So, but you often use Mandarin. Um, yes, I I use Mandarin most of the time. But when I uh, chatting with my family, mm. I also can use Taiwanese. Mm. Yeah, that must be beautiful. So this is like the last question. I just want to know um, what people in Taiwan call like some products. So yep. what do you call for coffee? Coffee. Uh, coffee in Mandarin is called cafe. Oh, it's similar sound. Yeah, 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 same. Yeah. What about computer? Computer is called 电脑. Oh, uh, it's different. So, or maybe you can also like call computer when you were in Taiwan. Yeah, we also can call it computer. Yeah. Okay. And smartphone. Is smartphone. Shouji. Oh. So mm. it sounds difficult. Yeah. <laughs> what about television? Television is we also call TV or mm. 电视. Yeah, yeah, same, same. Mm. And KFC, KFC. Yeah, we also can KFC, KFC or <laughs> Kentucky. Oh, oh, different. Yes, it's in Taiwan. Oh, okay. So, what's about Coca Cola? Coca Cola, same. Yeah, but not Coke. Ah, we also call Coke. Oh, yeah, same. And laptop, laptop. Same as computer, yeah. Oh, yeah. So it's like even ice cream, bing chi ling. Oh, bing chi ling. Bing chi Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's not difficult. Mm. What about tea? What do you tea. call tea? Cha. Cha. Oh yeah. 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 That's easy. like like gong cha. Yeah. That's, that's easy. Cha. That's very easy. I know. It's C H A. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. I think that's all our interview with Sally. So thank you so much. Don't worry. <laughs> so maybe we can have a chat and maybe different time. Yep. Yeah. So okay. I really enjoy this interview. So. See you next See time. You.